welcome to my channel. So I just got through reviewing this product. If you want to see that review, look below the video. Got my Evian water, but right now we're reviewing this. It's cauliflower from the ground up. I've had products from the ground up in the past. I think I did some review on them. Some of them are good and some of them are eh. Um, but this today, we're doing the cauliflower pretzel sticks. So it's gluten free. I believe it's certified gluten free. I don't know for sure. Is it certified or is it made in a facility with gluten? I don't know, but yep, it's certified gluten free. It's cassava flour, non GMO corn starch, expeller pressed canola oil, which is really healthy, salt, vegetable blend. This is what I don't like about it. It has a vegetable blend of spinach, broccoli, carrot, tomato, beet, shiitake mushroom, and then yeast. I had one of their other products. I can't remember what it was, but it had a blend of all those veggies, and it was like too much, and it reminded me of like fish food. Sorry to say that. Now, my roommate has been eating these, and he said it does remind me of him of fish food a lot. So, let's see here. It smells like pretzels. Oh no. He said he's been eating quite a bit. I was like, why are you eating if it reminds you of fish food? I think he's hungry. It's not as shiny. You know how a pretzel normally has a nice shine and smooth? It's not. It's quite a bit of salt. Mmm. Reminds me of brittle bones. Like, what is it? Like, you know, driftwood? how it becomes like um, dry rot or whatever it's called. I don't know if you can see the inside out. Instead of crispy, it's brittle. Okay. It tastes exactly what you think it tastes like. It tastes like cauliflower and a pretzel mix. But I'm pretty salty. Take some of that salt out and see what it tastes like. It's a pretzel. It's supposed to be salty, right? I think it tastes better without the salt. So, now, what's this? I'm going to tell you what this is. So, on the review on this, it tastes like a pretzel with cauliflower. It's more, instead of crispy, it's... What's that word I said? I don't remember now. Like petrified wood. But it's not hard. So go ahead, you got a good crunch. But we're gonna try it with this. I just made this is raw vegan pea hummus. Made with peas. Green peas. I'm gonna try it with this. So I just made this yesterday. And I'll leave the link below the video on the recipe, or I might put it on my Instagram. I also have an Instagram account, so yeah, check that out. I made this last night, yesterday evening, whatever. That's not yesterday. And I liked it, but I didn't know what to put it on. And I had forgot these were in the cupboard that my roommate's been kind of munching on. You know what? We don't eat these by themselves. And you can, but... If you make this dip, it did not taste good. That It didn't... It, was not, it wasn't all that great with carrots and cucumber. I actually made a lettuce wrap with iceberg lettuce. It was okay, but this and this together... If you get these, they're way too salty though for me. I have high blood pressure. But yeah, so don't forget to look below the video to my um, my recipe for this. It is, what did I say it was? <laughs> it's hummus. Green pea hummus instead with chickpeas. It's raw vegan. What is raw vegan? It's plant-based vegan, but instead of cooking it, you make it, you eat it raw. 
That's really good. Check out that recipe. Mm. Don't forget to check out this. It's below the video. I'll leave a link below. Oh, just look at my history. This is really good, by the way. This, what am I going to give it? If you like cauliflower and you're gluten-free, I give this like a solid 8.5 out of, well, I give it a 7.5 out of 10. Yeah, 7.5 out of 10. If you're not crazy about cauliflower, you want something gluten-free, well, then it's a zero because it tastes like cauliflower. It's not strong, like, oh, it tastes like cauliflower, but it does have a pretzel taste. But then it's like, what is that little extra, extra? Tastes like cauliflower. Well, again, again, four dollars, four ounces. No, but they have another. They make another item. I can't remember the name of it. I think it was a cheese puff or something that was really good. So please, until next time, please comment, like, subscribe. Let me know what foods you want me to try. And don't forget to drink your Evian water. <laughs> And hit the bell icon, because when you hit the bell icon, it will alert you when I have new videos. Until next time, let me know. Please let me know what you want me to try next or what you want me to talk about. All right. Have an awesome day. Bye-bye.